magic, to engage in magic, to participate in black magic, to ask for it, to go and seek it, and to be a party of it. All of that is considered al-mubiqat from among those sins that are extremely destructive in the dunya and the akhirah. Why? The Prophet Muhammad says, Man sahara faqad ashrak. Whoever casts a spell has associated partners with Allah. My brothers, my sisters, it is rampant across the globe. Now it is becoming more where people are participating in magic to get things. Subhanallah, people are engaging in magic, thinking that by us doing something like this, we are going to achieve goodness, not realizing you are cutting the umbilical cord between you and Allah in a figurative way. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us. Never ever resort to magic or some superstitious dealings in order to achieve something or in order to destroy something. Never do that. It is too costly. It will cost you your Jannah. It will cost you your relation with Allah. Don't do it. Don't go to someone to say, I have a problem. I want to marry a married woman. I need you to cast a spell so that they are divorced. La hawla wa la quwwata illa billah. People are doing this. And you know what? They are not happy after that as well. Because shaitan dangles a dirty carrot, not realizing that you will achieve nothing from this. Besides shaitan telling Allah, you see, I told you. وَقَالَ الشَّيْطَانُ لَمَّا قُضِيَ الْأَمْرُ إِنَّ اللَّهَ وَعَدَكُمْ وَعْدَ الْحَقِّ وَوَعَدْتُكُمْ فَأَخْلَفْتُكُمْ وَمَا كَانَ لِيَ عَلَيْكُمْ مِنْ سُلْطَانٍ إِلَّا أَنْ دَعَوْتُكُمْ فَاسْتَجَبْتُمْ لِي فَلَا تَلُومُونِي وَلُومُوا أَنفُسَكُمْ Shaytan on the day of judgment will tell Allah, O oh Allah, or oh, in fact, shaitan will say that Allah has promised you a true promise and I just gave you a false promise. You are the one who listened to me. I didn't force you to do anything. You came to me with, the, with I had a false promise. You left Allah who had the true promise and now you are here. You are stuck. Don't blame me. Blame yourself. That is shaitan's statement. So my brothers and sisters, we need to talk about this. Magic is something that if a person participates in it in any way, shape or form, they are compromising their relationship with Allah and even destroying it.